How is it? Oh. What's inside? Is it a banana or an ice cream? Banana uh, flavored ice cream? Yeah. yeah. Banana flavor. Oh. Mm-hmm. Mm, I thought chocolate that probably into an ice cream and um it's banana ice cream and it's rather good. In Neville's 1968 lecture, Eschatology, the Drama of the End, Neville talks about all the turmoil in the world, and yet we are all one. But when we think on the lowest level as men, we find we can't solve the problems of the world. And Neville's teaching you it's changed through a radical change in the attitude of your mind. So no matter what fact confronts you, is not everything possible to the imagination which Neville likens to God, and God's name being I am. So whatever you put after that, you can change the facts in your imagination, and persisted, he teaches it becomes reality. And Neville wants you to put these things to the test, and have your own experiences, so you can teach from experience. Neville says, as I mentioned a few months ago, who knows what the awakened man is doing when he shoots his arrows beyond the world of dream? You can't deviate from God's plan. If you awaken within yourself, and it's the plan that awakens, you are the plan that awoke. So you shoot the plan to those you love. So as you go about exercising your imagination, you will come to wake up. And with your experiences and awakening, you too will teach others. For a moment, take the turmoils of the world. Forget trying to resolve them from the outer man. Turn to your awareness that is aware of these words, the inner man, the imagination, and the symbolism of all what the outer means with your own inner consciousness. Take it there to resolve. If the outer world was filled with peace, what in your inner consciousness would change? And now feel this change. Perfumey soda, but kind of good. Mmm, very crispy and gooey. Not quite as flavorful as the American counterpart. Just nuts. Mmm, just nuts. So, so, mama, dot, dot.